The floodlights are shining down on the players here at Old Trafford in Manchester. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and sharing duties with me today, Stuart Robson. And no question, this ought to be a game that gets pulses racing. It is Manchester United versus Marseille. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Well, Manchester United have chosen this particular shape. David De Gea between the posts. Harry Maguire plays alongside Rafael Varane in central defence. Frenkie de Jong plays alongside Christian Eriksen in the centre of midfield. And leading the attack today is Cristiano Ronaldo. And here's how it looks for Marseille. It's the impressive Paul Lopez between the posts. Genghis Undo starts with Dimitri Payet in the wide areas. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. And the emphasis is on creativity. Now possibilities in the centre. Gendouzi. And back with Milik. Excellent passing. Can he do it to take the lead? Boubacar Camara. Textbook defending inside the box. Given his magnificent form, then there's every reason to believe that Cristiano Ronaldo will make an impact here. Well, Derek, he's the perfect finisher. He's got a great shot in the Well, let's look at this again. He's done superbly well to pick out a teammate here, but I think the keeper has made a mistake here. While it's a decent finish, it shouldn't go in at that near post. So, underway again here. 1 0 the score. Chalet Atsar. It's with Camara. And very deftly cut out. Lisandro Martinez. And what can they do to stop him running at them? Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Payet. A really intense pressure applied. Oh, he's lost possession. Ericsson. De Jong. Ericsson. And closed down straight away. Very quick thinking there. Arkadiusz Milic. Gerson. Payet. And now Arkadiusz Milic. Really getting stuck in defensively. Well, as you can see, United just haven't been able to dictate the pace of the game. But their counter-attacking has been really good, particularly in the wide areas. It's been an excellent performance from them so far. Ronaldo. And still danger here. Well, he's thumped it out of there without much fuss. And snuffing out the danger. United might be able to cash in. Well, the referee not too happy with the challenge and blows for a free kick. Well, that save could be the turning point here because they've been second best all over the pitch up to now. Payet. 
It's with Camara. Milik! Excellent defending. Oh, terrific save from the keeper. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? And there's the delivery. Struggling to get it away. Do you Chaleta Sar? Gendouzi. And that will do it for the first half here at the Theatre of Dreams. The second half underway, United with the advantage, but no room for complacency. Jaden Sancho. Malasia. It's with Martinez. It needs an accurate cross. But defensive efficiency there. Well, Christian Eriksen, a player with a tremendous eye, Stuart, and using it to good effect. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. Possibilities inside the box. And now they have the ball back. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. Ericsson. Ericsson. defending but can they keep it out body in the way now oh, doesn't get away with it free kick given substitution for Manchester United coming off the pitch number 32 Christian Eriksen coming onto the pitch well, as the stats confirm, Marseille have controlled the ball, but their attacking play has been too slow, mainly due to a lack of movement of the front players. At some point, they have to threaten the space in behind the defenders, otherwise they're going to lose this. And the cross is very much on. Bruno Fernandes, great defending here. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Well, it's amazing how fans can be so blinkered with their views. They're going mad here. And a chance for him on the flank. But really sticking to the task defensively. Frankie de Jong. And can they prize them open now? De Jong... Great challenge, he got nothing but ball. Arkadiusz Milik. Now with Cengi Zunda. Bubakar Kamara. Not getting it forward, but they need an equaliser. 
But he could really get at the opposition. This could square the game. The crossbar got in the way. Well, what a dramatic finish. How close was that? They should be able to hold on now with not much longer left. Now, let's see what they can do here. And the referee says corner kick. Here's a change for Manchester United. And now the delivery. No nonsense clearance. Good physical play. Just cutting off the supply. Gerson. Bubakar Kamara. So two minutes of stoppage time to be added on. And the pass was just that little bit off. Nearly found its target. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. Bubakar Kamara. And the referee blows for full time. Positives for Manchester United. Three points for them. What did you make of it all? Well, Derek, it was a really tight game, but they were the better side over the 90 minutes, and they fully deserved their victory today. Well, we all know he can be a joy to watch, Christian Eriksen. How would you sum up his performance? Well, he gave them a really hard time, didn't he? His speed of thought was excellent, and he took the winning goal so well. He was brilliant today.